Hello, I'm Carla. Thanks for joining me again. Yesterday when I recorded about our latest additions to my physio routine, I forgot to discuss what this was for. So I thought I'd show you quickly two other things that I do. The physio was finding that the thoracic spine is becoming a little bit immobile and um, she kind of really works into each thoracic vertebra quite strongly. So I like to take a little stress ball and you just come to lying down on your back and you're going to place the ball at the base of the thoracic. So at the base of the shoulder blade region, kind of there. So as I said, I've been working with my physio. So she has, I know exactly which are the vertebrae that she works to try and loosen. So you're just going to spend a few breaths here. If you want to straighten your legs for the more classic Shavasana position, you do. And spend a few quiet breaths here, just focusing on the breath, relaxing the body over that stress or feeling it digging in. So you would spend a few more breaths than I am on each vertebra, but then you'll kind of caterpillar yourself down and then... Again, settling, making sure that the ball is absolutely, or the vertebra is centered on the ball, and that ball is gently nudging the vertebra in, giving it a little bit of mobility as you exhale and release the rest of the body down over that um, stress ball. And then again, you would spend a few more breaths there than I am showing, but you'd slowly continue your way down until eventually the ball is near the base of the neck. Each time you place yourself, you want to settle centrally, you want to relax the sides of the body down, you want to relax the arms and the hands. And then don't work too much into the neck, but if you do have a hump at the base of the neck, if this is painful, just listen to your body. If it's a strain on the neck, take a blanket for under the head. Otherwise, just be there for a few breaths near the base of the neck. And you'd bend your knees, roll over to come up. Okay, so the tennis balls, you basically are just going to take two tennis balls and you can put them in a sock, I suppose, or I've wrapped them in tape. And... Because the right arm was doing a lot of the work and holding a lot of the force for the left arm, it, I've also started to strain some of the muscles in the right arm. So, and I cannot reach them with the left arm to rub them. So you place these two tennis balls against the wall and you want to cup your upper arm on the tennis ball here. So just showing from the side here, you want to place the tennis balls Get your upper arm in, and then you're going to roll. And as you roll, sort of try and find that spot that needs a little bit of needing to release, find um, sort of that sweet point. And if you get, you know, you can move it around, so sometimes it's more in the joint that it's um, caught and strained. So just by massaging into with the wall up is into the tennis ball, I found really quite relieving. Also, if um, from wearing the sling, I've still got that bump on my arm. You can see where the physio has had a good go of it. So again, placing the upper arm on the tennis ball, cradling it there, and just moving from side to side so that it rolls up and down the upper arm. And that kind of soothes that um, nodule and helps to break down the um, scar tissue. So yeah, I try and add some of those whenever I need to. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. Namaste.